Hello everyone, welcome to Groompy Man's Reviews. Today I'm reviewing the Wax Mac Air Revive. This is a powerful, lightweight, full size vacuum. Model number UCA2GEV1. Right, let me get it unboxed and then we'll see if it's any good. This is everything out of the box of the Wax Mac Air Revive. So, first let's look at the swing ticket. So, we've got A for energy, A for dust emissions, A for carpet. C for hard flow and it's 80 decibels you get an instruction manual they have this on sale I bought this from Curry's UK and the instruction manual tells you how to look after the vacuum cleaner what the motors are and everything and it only comes with this 3-in-1 tool so basically it's that's a dusting brush crevice and then your upholstery tool and it'll be easy to store as well so you, you, you could use them like either way you can right? so if, if you were to do it that way that's your dusting brush and see on this side you just push that and it would release and then you could turn it around and then you'd simply push that on and then you would have your upholstery tool or you could take it off to use your crevice tool to get into the nooks and crannies it's that but this has an 820 watt motor as I mentioned before, it weighs 5 kgs and it has a 7 meter power cord, which is a decent size. That's the wand. And you can also, before I get onto the main, main bit, right, so what, what you can do is this directly connects onto the hose or you could connect it to the wand. So if you're going to connect it to the hose, take the hose off and you'd just put it on and you could do your above flow cleaning or if you did want to put it onto the wand connect this onto the wand first like so and then the tool would go on to the bottom end of the wand and then you could do your above flow cleaning right so that first just click that on it's got a suction control there so if you're doing a low pile carpet or hardwood you close this and it will give you the full suction but if you're on a deep pile carpet you simply open this reduce it and then it would be easy to push because I don't know if you've uh, seen my review of uh, the wax air I did it a while, uh, about a year ago that was basically when I was vacuuming on a deep pile carpet it was really really difficult but then when I simply switched it over to that it was okay this is a recliner a little footprint there so if it reclines let's have a look at the bottom end of the machine so at the bottom it has two big wheels at the back and then it's got two little roller wheels and then it's got a felt strip there it's got one there and two there that's not to scratch your floor and then the brush bar it is quite stiff that and it goes all the way around because the main suction path is down here pick the dirt up from there and it would take it into the pipe through there and then into the bin if you do want to get further access to the brush bar to cut hair and stuff you could remove this plate with the, the three screws and then there's a little plate in there you remove that and the brush bar would come off so you could cut the hairs easily this is the 2018 model of the wax mac air revive so this has got two hepa filters it's got a post motor filter located up here and a pre motor filter at the bottom i'll show you them in a bit but i'll take the bin off and i'll show you how to empty the bin as well while we're there push this button here the bin would come off and then to empty the bin there's a button there simply push that and then drop everything off but you can do a further clean of the shroud and the bin itself i'll show you that in a moment if you can see them paddle lock signs that lock on and lock off twist this that's open and then it's on the floor you can see the filter there and there's a bit of extra cloth pull that off you tap it and you can wash but make sure it's fully dry before you put it back into the machine there it's got the multi cyclones now if you did want to give it a further clean you could remove this as well pull this off like so you can wipe the bin and then you could like brush this off it's only one way it would go back on it simply just fit in like so you put the filter back in this piece of cloth is on top so you simply put that back in and then the head top bit go on again you could see the little arrow there at the bottom here is the post motor HEPA filter to get to that you simply twist it it comes off and you do not wash this all you do is 
simply take it off and you tap it and then if you've got the machine if you've had it for a long time put it from wax they, they, they're not they're not expensive at all this uh, does have a two-year guarantee with it but make sure to register with wax that again just fit on and it just clicks on the bin on it's really simple you can't get it wrong because as you can see the open vent sections there and then you can see you just put it back on there and just click it back on so the three moon tool sits there behind there that I must admit that was a bit difficult to figure out which way it sits on it's got a quick cord release so if you push that down the cord would come off now at the bottom here it's got buttons there that's obviously the power on off button now that one there is for turning the brush bar off when you're using it on hard floors and turning it on when you're using it on carpets now this here is to release the wand push this and the wand would come off now I must admit I like the colour red so I like the colour on this and I like how simple it is you know there's not much fuffing around with it it was really easy to assemble so I put some oats down on my laminar and I put some oats down on my rug and I've selected the full suction because they're not a deep pile carpet so for this instance they do say use the full suction so let's see how the wax performs and on the first one when I'm doing the laminar I will have the brush bar off as wax recommend and then when I'm doing the rug I'll have the brush bar on You know, that is not bad, you know, and it, it, it's quiet as well. The, the, the motor's really quiet because it's obviously with the new EU laws, they've got to be 80 decibels or below, and that were quiet with the brush bar. Now, for this, I'm going to turn the brush bar on. I don't know if you picked that up on camera but even though this is a, a rug, a really low pile rug, the vacuum is actually struggling so I will need to reduce the suction by sliding this down. But he asked again, cleared up in one pass, the oats are cleared up in one pass. There you have my review of the Wax Mac Air Revive 2018. I am totally impressed with this and this is a product that I would recommend. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in my next video.